Here's how to make a mini medi first aid kit. This is a miniature first aid kit that you could store in your pocket, your purse, or even a fanny pack for minor boo-boos. Rather than having the typical band-aids and gauze like you see in other first aid kits, I like using more of the modern wound dressings that you would get when going to the hospital. These wound dressings are a lot more expensive, but they're high quality. I like storing my band-aids in the back of my cell phone behind the case. But here's what I currently have in my mini medi. Starting off first, I have a few Sterostrip reinforced skin closures. These can be used for taping your skin together if you were to get a cut. So while they're not stitches, they're used for the same purpose. Next, I have two Aquacel Extra Wound Dressings. These are composed of two layers of hydrofiber technology that are stitched together. This type of hydrofiber dressing is specifically suited to help manage moderately to highly exuding wounds. When it gets wet from blood, it turns into a gel-like substance, which helps when you eventually remove the bandage as you don't want to peel off a scab. Next, I have a few sheets of Tegaderm Transparent Film Dressing. These are often used when you're at the hospital for IV sites. These provide a waterproof, stale barrier. The breathable film lets oxygen in and moisture vapor out. I use these in conjunction with the Aquacel Extras. Next, I have a Medvance 2x2 bordered silicone foam dressing, which is a multi-layer, highly absorbent dressing with soft silicone adhesive as the wound contact layer. These come in various sizes, but the multi-layer structure absorbs a lot of blood. The next item is a Medvance 2x2 bordered hydrocolloid dressing. It has a cohesive gel that's produced when it comes in contact with a wound to provide a moist wound healing environment. So for wounds, you want them not too dry and not too moist. You want to have them just right. I also have a few smaller All Health Advanced Fast Healing Hydrocolloid Gel Bandages. These provide a 100% waterproof seal that protects against germs and supports the body's natural healing. They can last to seven days on a wound, provide pain relief, and helps reduce scarring. I also have a few packs of triple antibiotic ointment. These can be used for all kinds of minor cuts, burns, and abrasions. The next item is a Wetterspoon on-the-go raw premium Manuka Honey, K-Factor 16. Manuka Honey is kind of a magical and mysterious honey from New Zealand. While it has an awesome flavor profile, I use it for burns. So if you get a burn, cover it with Manuka Honey, and then use one of those Tegaderm films on top of it to protect it from bacteria. And last, I store an individual on-the-go dude wipe. These are flushable wipes that I use for wiping down a wound before applying one of the modern wound dressings. You could also use it for its normal purpose in the restroom. And those are all of the items that I store in my Mini Medi first aid kit. Thanks for watching. <laughs>